KV331 audio updates SynthMaster 2 and SynthMaster 2 player to version 2.9.12 with NKS and VST3 compatibility. Welcome to Music Gears where we bring you the latest info on new music instruments, software, and other gear from around the world. KV331 Audio recently announced the latest version 2.9.12 update for their SynthMaster 2 and SynthMaster 2 player software synthesizers. This update brings two major new features. Compatibility with Native Instruments Native Control Standard NKS NKS allows SynthMaster 2 and SynthMaster Player to be seamlessly integrated with Native Instruments machine and complete control hardware and software. Compatibility with VST3 format VST3 has been a long-standing feature request from SynthMaster 2 users, and KV331 Audio finally managed to deliver it. SynthMaster 2 and SynthMaster 2 Player can now run in VST3 format as well, on Windows, 64-bit Intel, and Mac OS, 64-bit Intel or Apple Silicon, platforms. For SynthMaster 1 users, an update is on the way in the coming weeks. Aside from those two major features, there are critical bug fixes slash improvements in this release as well. New, added auto-assign slash remove easy parameters feature. New, modulation matrix entries can now grow as necessary, previous limit was 64 entries. New, when a preset is loaded via MIDI program change, preset browser filter is now updated. New, preset banks are now stored under public documents folder instead of users documents folder. New, free version of SynthMaster Player now comes with 600 factory presets. New, demo version of SynthMaster 2 now comes with 1200 factory presets. Fixed, SynthMaster Player doesn't load FX bypass parameters correctly. Fixed, SynthMaster might stop responding to MIDI CC messages when it receives multiple CC messages. Fixed, SynthMaster has inconsistencies displaying parameter values. Fixed, mono trigger doesn't work correctly for the very first note. Fixed, 24 dB per October digital HP slash BP slash BS filters don't work correctly. Registered SynthMaster slash SynthMaster player users can simply download the latest update by checking for updates inside the plugin windows. Please like this video if you found it helpful, and if you'd like to stay informed on the latest in music gear releases and limited time discount offers, please subscribe. Thanks for watching.